The following is a commercial presentation brought to you by Collectibles Guru. Hi, I'm Gary Ashburn, and I've been working in the world of collectibles and memorabilia for over 30 years. Here at the Collectibles Guru, we only bring you genuine and exclusive memorabilia from the worlds of sport, music, TV and film, heritage, and even more. Every item we bring you will come with a certificate of authenticity. It'll have our name, our address, our phone number. In other words, you can always contact us. And most important, we're a member of Aftal, who are one of the top three autograph trade associations in the world. This means that every collectible item we bring you is guaranteed 100% genuine. So when we say an item is signed, we guarantee it is hand signed and not a printed or a facsimile signature. So if you're looking for a unique, unusual and highly collectible gift for yourself or for someone you love, then this is the place to be. Hello everybody and a very good evening. Welcome to Sporty Stuff TV. Welcome to the Collectibles Guru. My name is Ben Mosby and we are set, ready and round to go for another hour of amazing collectibles. Something a little bit different tonight for you as well. New and exclusive collectibles. And if you've been enjoying all of the savings that we've been giving you over the course of the last few weeks, more chances for you to save on this show as well. I'll give you more details about that a little bit later on, but we've got a stellar lineup that I know uh, Gazza is going to be going through in just a few moments' time, talking about the man himself. Remember a few years ago when Justin Timberlake was bringing Sexy back? This man is bringing the double denim back. Yes, it's Gary Ashford. How are you, mate? Look at him. Look How at you him. doing? You all right? I'm yeah. loving this tonight. No, this is what you didn't look like. You know, you're not meant to look like, isn't it, really? I thought I looked like a fading rock star, maybe an aging rock star, maybe both, really. But yeah, I thought it's Goldfred. He says you can't wear denim and denim, but yeah. yeah. I, I'm, I'm absolutely loving it, mate. And um, tonight on the show, as you said, new and Great. exclusive, uh, you can save 10% on any order tonight oh, uh, with no. the I uh, know on this one yeah on this one on God, this one dear. with okay. the code save I'll remind you of that throughout the show but it's a brilliant lineup some amazing items which a lot of people won't have seen before well, there's a lot of items that I don't think have ever been on British television before to be honest and this is probably one um, Paul Newman you know very very rare um, it's one of the most sought after signatures but a very very difficult one to get hence the price mm. there uh, great sort of 10 by 8 there in black and white, classic photo of him, and hand signed by the man himself. Then from rare to even rarer, this is of course Humphrey Bogart and uh, Lauren Bacall, they did four movies together, but a great classic black and white photograph there. And it's personally signed by wow. both. Extremely rare, never seen one before. Then we have Cristiano Ronaldo, always very popular. That's a uh, personally signed Manchester United home shirt there. Um, signed on the front. We do also have an away shirt that's signed on the back. Oh, nice. But have a little look on the website. Oh, David Bowie. Anything of Bowie is red, red, red hot at the moment. Very, very, very rare. We occasionally get a photograph of him. We had a good link to, uh, I better not say where, but some people where he used to work in America, and we managed to get a few. But that is hand signed by Bowie himself. Then we have a few of these figures. This one is uh, Captain Kirk, and of course, uh, there, Captain Kirk, sorry. In its original, I was going to say, it's original box. It's a limited edition, very, very rare. And it all, the fact it's in the original box makes it very, very special. Then we have the uh, nurse, Christina Chapel there. Um, for, this is a Starfleet exclusive, uh, sorry, Starfleet uh, command figure. Yeah. And it's uh, an exclusive again, again, in its original box. This is Miley Cyrus there, uh, framed and mounted, great photographic image, and her genuine hand signed signature. She's always hot, hot, hot at the moment, this lady, isn't she? Absolutely. Very popular. That's beautifully framed, big professional piece. Mike Tyson, that's a big glove that you wouldn't want smashing into you, innit? You know? <laughs> exactly right. Red glove from Mike Tyson himself. This was signed mm. at a special, a private signing in Vegas before the uh, last but one fight of Tyson Fury and Deontay Wilder. This is one of those special limited edition discs that we get. These are uh, really rare. Only so many are made to come to the UK, but uh, very, very special. They're normally a live concert that took place on the radio, recreated onto a record and in blue vinyl. Brand new oh, one here, Will brilliant. Smith. This is, of course, the Fresh Prince of uh, Bel Air there. Uh, again, 
great images of the man himself and genuinely his his uh, genuine genuine hand signed signature all framed up they're big pieces those as well about 18 and a half by 24 big big pieces anyone else got the uh, fresh prince tune in, the, in their head now i have uh, <laughs> lots to come tonight as you can see hopefully you'll see something that you love on the show if you don't uh, as we always say there's tons more items on the website collectiblesguru.com that's where you can shop and also you can of course call us 0800 254 5402 and just to remind you you can save 10 percent on any order with the code SAVE, S-A-V-E, until the end of Saturday. So again, do yourself a favour. He won't like me for saying it, but <laughs> it's my job to tell you. Uh, so make sure you use that code, get an extra 10% off. If you see something that you love, maybe like this first item, it's certainly going to uh, help it a little bit easier on the old wallet if you can save an extra 10% off. This is item 492142 of, uh, I don't think I'm over-egging the pudding here when I say you've got like a real legend of uh, Hollywood. Here, a you? true legend of Hollywood and um, obviously you know not been with us for quite some time but in his life he didn't lead a very sort of you know he, did, he wasn't out and about in all the uh, press do's and stuff he was quite a private person allegedly mm. so very very difficult signature to get uh, your hands on this comes from one of the uh, biggest uh, dealers in in America a member of Aftal PDSA everything like that it comes from him so you've got tip-top provenance remember all of the autographs we bring you here are genuinely hand signed we do have one or two cheaper <coughs> items that are printed but we always make that very 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 clear. This, of course, has been held in the hand uh, by Paul Newman and personally signed. Great image of him there as well. And he was a great actor. I love Paul Newman. I remember him watching Cool Hand Luke. Do you remember that movie when he had, he had to eat all the eggs? Do you remember that? I don't know. I don't know. Oh, no, it. Was, he all the eggs. Eggs. Yeah. yeah, he had to eat so many eggs for a bet, you know. Yeah. And you could see him get a bit like me, you know, look like he's had a few <laughs> eggs. <laughs> I don't eat too many eggs, not that you care. But he was, it's a great movie. Yeah. And then, of course, I loved him in The Sting with Robert Redford. Yeah, it was great he, uh, movie Butch as Cassidy well. as well. Yeah, Butch Cassidy, yeah, yeah, he was in that as well. Yeah, he was, they were great, you know, they, they worked together well, those two as well. Mm. They're a great actor, highly, highly sought after, and very little around, hence the price. But it's, um, as far as I'm aware, we've never, ever had him on British television before. Just, um, so very, very rare. There are a couple on here, that I've, like Bogart, I've never seen yeah. one anywhere on. Very, very rare. Normally, the only places you'd see something like this is possibly in a Christie's or a Bonham's auction. Yeah. or I'd say Sotheby's, but they don't have auctions of that type of material. So it's very, very rare. Maybe uh, Julian's in America, somewhere like that. But very, very rare that they come up. And when they do, the prices go through the roof roof sometimes if you get two or three people chasing that that could you know could go for well, silly that's all money. it takes isn't it you get a couple of people who want to get their hands in there and all of a sudden that is going for ridiculous amounts um yeah. daniel just said say in my ear there of course towering um, inferno he was in another big movie yeah, and of course, of course. Um, uh, the Colour of uh, Money with um, uh, Tom Cruise. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. One yeah. of, like, Tom Cruise's first yeah, movies. That's right. So a guy, again, he was, like, <coughs> acting right through all the decades. He was a great fan. He was married to the actress, wasn't he? Um, was it... Was it Sir Joanne Woodward, wasn't yes. he? he was married to, yeah, yeah, and um, yeah, he, he's a great actor, amazing actor, and it's one that a lot of people really, really want in their collection, and he's very, very, very difficult to get. But if you're building a collection as well, that's one you've really got to think about because yeah. that is something again, you know, I hate touching on this, but there's one or two items to tonight's show. Um, never buy for speculation because no, you don't no. know what's going to happen. But based on past performance over the last couple of decades, items like this have got more and more valuable as the years tick away because there's so little of it. And right at this minute as well, memorabilia is going for big bucks in a lot of auctions simply because in the right, you know, specialist auctions, there was a football recently sold for two two point one million at Grand Bud. You know, there's um, there's a lot of a lot of items, Alan Balls. Alan Ball's medal recently sold as well. That was over 200,000. There's a lot of interest in memorabilia. Uh, simply, I think what's happened as well is when shares and pensions are bubbling around, mm. people think, blow this, and they take a bit of money and put it in something they enjoy. And if you want to do it, do it, you know, because obviously we can't guarantee any of these are going to increase in value that, that, and, and don't buy them for speculation. Buy them because when you put them on the wall or you give them to that special person in your life, they you realise that whole face lights up with pleasure because that's what you're going to get when you get these sort of people gifts. You know, 
this super item, very rare, grab it while you can. Yeah, like, do you know what? If you love your movies, if you're a, co a serious collector and you're looking to get, you know, a collection of Hollywood greats, this is a guy who's absolutely got to be in that collection. And what an opportunity this evening. First come, first served on this. And, you know, whilst that 529.99, I think, is a great, great buy for a piece just like this, remember, you can save yourself almost an extra £53 by using that code SAVE, S-A-V-E, which takes you down under £500 tonight. Use ClearPay as well if you want to spread the cost four ways. More details of that a little bit later on, but what an opportunity that Paul Newman personally signed. 13 by 10 inch mounted classical uh, film photo display. 492142 is your item number. I tell you what, we've started strong today. What a strong uh, couple of first items. Yeah. Paul Newman, and then you talk about Hollywood royalty. This next item, once again, I mean, uh, once in a lifetime, opportunity potentially to get your hands on something like this Humphrey Bogart and Lauren Bacall really really rare um, I've only ever seen one before and it was in major high street auction house where they signed together yeah they did four movies actually together as well um, I know one was the big sleep was one of the key Largo I think key Largo yeah. yeah and um, but again they I mean Humphrey Bogart is like a you know, a, a, a legend, legend, I don't know what you call him really. Massive, massive interest and very, very rare. This once again comes from a, a member of all the official societies in America and here. And so it comes with impeccable provenance. You get a lifetime guarantee with it. And uh, all the, everything you need to know that you're buying something that's very, very desirable. It's a piece of true cinema nostalgia there. Yeah. Re as is the Paul Newman, really. Very, 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 very rare. And uh, uh, again, if you buy that now, you're saving yourself some money tonight as well. But not only that, it's very, very difficult. I have never seen a Humphrey, a genuine Humphrey Bogart for sale on his own for less than a thousand pounds anyway. So you're getting Lauren Bacall because they're both in it and they've done so many movies together. That would make it more valuable than having two separate photos of them as well. Yeah, and like you say, someone. when you consider prices, you think that that you know one thousand one hundred ninety-nine is. I, I, I know obviously it's a considered purchase, but to to get those two signatures, I think that is a, a great price tonight. And again, like you say, you imagine something like this in auction, two people, two or three people that are after that, that could go for considerably more, couldn't it? It, it would, I mean, normally the only place you'd see things like this is in one of the major high street auction houses. Mm -hmm. And even there, very, very, very rare. Um, uh, because there's just so little around. This is something that normally would be in a, a film a film industry mm. museum yeah. or a very high-end collector, you know, probably in the States or somewhere like that. But it, it is extremely rare. Um, we only have the one, and once it's gone, I have no idea if we'll ever bring another one on TV again. Highly unlikely, because mm. it is that rare. And if you put that in a, well, either of these first couple of items, in a charity auction in the right environment or in a special this film and TV auction, the prices for these could go through the roof. As you say, you get two or three people chasing them. Mm. Really, really rare. And if you're building a, a collection or you're looking for something, you know, really unusual and unique, that that is that is exactly what you've got with both of these first two items. Yeah, and both of them are. I mean, particularly this one, going back even further in time to that sort of golden era of if, if, you know when movies were still kind of like new, weren't they? Do you know yeah. what I mean? And two of the original stars of Hollywood, really. Yeah, really. I know for sure. You imagine I'm a terrible one for imagining what they're actually saying there he's looking at her and going really <laughs> and she's going yes go to hell or something like that <laughs> yeah. maybe that's me reenacting my own life <laughs> when i get a look like that you know i love you go to hell okay fine Fair i enough. think if that was you or maybe your other was like i've done the hoovering really doesn't yeah. look like it <laughs> yeah yeah same thing yeah yeah <laughs> thought you were cooking dinner really oh god let's get a takeaway um, but anyway it's uh can't go wrong yeah you know, great can't. image great photograph two genuine signatures remember keep all the provenance that comes with it keep the certificate of authenticity and everything because it certainly adds to the value and the interest come the day you ever want to move that on and you can save yourself a hefty chunk of course tonight as well literally again that is first come first serve but save yourself a hefty chunk by using that code save at the checkout and get yourself an extra 10% off. That is only applicable though, as you can see on screen, until the 11th of March. Uh, I have a funny feeling that we have a lot of people watch this show now, and I think that the fact that there's only one of these, that that's not going to be here potentially on the 11th of March. So please, if you like the look of it, um, if, if that's within budget tonight, you're getting yourself a true, true piece of movie memorabilia 
right there. Humphrey Bogart, Lauren Bacall, personally signed by the two, framed black and white uh, film photo display. That is an absolute beauty. 410369 is the item number on that one. All right, next up, um, we have got, again, a real mixture this evening of uh, film greats and dipping into the world of music, uh, talking about absolute legends in the world of uh, rock and music in general. Queen, uh, this is item 392171. Now, these discs are always very popular when we bring them on the show, but for people who haven't um, seen these before, just take us around exactly what we're going to be getting here. Yeah, these are framed, um, some are gold, some are platinum. They're actually 24 by 20 inches, so they're bigger than the normal uh, discs. They come with a, a they come complete with a great photograph of the band and you get the CD cover. The format of them, apart from these, are, are bigger than normal, but the format, apart from that, is exactly the same as what they do now when they present them to the artists yeah. or for the management people for the company. So these are true re replicas of the original disc, but the, even even more important, there's only a hundred of these produced. They're all numbered individually. So you see on the plaque just underneath the picture there, that'll give you the number. So whatever one you get is the only one in the world. And these were only done originally for a tele another TV station, uh, national TV station as well that we're, we've seen them on. Yeah. But once these have gone, we don't have anywhere near a hundred. This has been one of the most popular. And I believe we're now down to less than, I think about 15 to 20 yeah, in got total. Of these, yeah. Once they're gone, then you won't see them anymore. So very, very special, very rare. And I'll tell you what, you hang them on the wall and they really do look super. They turn heads. Yeah. A lot of people, I mean, there's quite a few people, I'll say Alan, I know down in Clacton, he's built a collection of them. I know Julie has got a bar down in Southampton. You put them around the wall and they look stunning, you know, really do. I used to have them in my office, you know, old flat, you know, when I lived down in, in, in South, in Surrey. I had them around the wall, you know. I know you've probably heard the story, so I'm sorry if you have, but basically we had them, yeah, oh, sorry, we had them around the wall and they looked fabulous. And when we were getting out of there, you know, I had a bit of a, a crack down the wall. No one ever noticed the crack. <laughs> they said, my God, are you in the music trade? You go, yeah, yeah, I do a bit, you know. I look like an old rock star now, don't I? But anyway, look like they, 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 look fa yeah, rock they look fabulous. Yeah. yeah, my old man's a dustman maybe, but anyway. <laughs> um, but they look stunning. Whoever yeah. you buy them for will love that. And remember, that will, the one that you get, Get, you'll be the only person in the world ever to own that one. Mm. So they're very rare. They look fabulous. And if you've got a Queen fan in, yeah. the, in the family, do have a look at them. I think as well with someone in a band like Queen always still being played on the radio. A lot more interest in the band now, of course, with the uh, the movie, which was out just a few years ago. So you're mm. almost getting like a, a a new sort of era of Queen fans coming through. Right. So this is going to exactly be even more happening. sought after, isn't it? And vinyl now is hot, really mm. collectible again, you know. Do go on the website yeah. as well, you know, www.collectiblesguru.com. There's a whole range of these discs, but they do sell very fast. And I tell you what, we always say they should have a health warning, because once you've got one, <laughs> yeah. you're certainly going to want more. Yeah. Uh, they do look the absolute business. And again, if you like the look of this on your TV screen, just wait till you get it in your hands at home, up close and personal. They look the absolute business, these. Uh, that is Queen's Greatest Hits, 24 by 20 inch frame gold disc and photo display. Limited edition of 100 of these remember uh, we have nowhere near like that amount so if you like that this evening you can get your hands on a wonderful limited edition piece for any music fan rock fan and indeed queen fan that needs to be snapped up 249 pounds 99 6250 is your first installment on clear pay but remember use that code check out save and you'll get another 10 percent off that price only up until the 11th of march though 392171 all right we're dotting around all over the place today from movies to music off to the the world of sport again now uh, and in particular the world of football very very hot property right now this guy uh, went through a bit of a sort of a barren patch didn't he and it's was, it was almost like it seemed like the, the the world cup seemed to help Marcus Rashford rediscover his form. Yeah I think he just started getting fit prior to it and they took him to the world cup and he's exceptionally mm. well there and since then he's been on fire in the premiership you yeah. know he's Manchester United's main man again and um, I think he had a lot of injuries you know after the lockdown and things like that he 
he did a lot of work there with the government, didn't he? Great mm. sort of social oh, yes. work to try and encourage uh, helping oh. people who needed help and kids. Yep. Great guy, done a lot of work, but certainly he's admired throughout the game and admired by people out of the game simply for all the work and effort he put in to bring in, a, you know, the needs of others to the forefront through his fame. But back to what he does best, you know, which is banging the ball in the net and quick off the mark and dangerous. He's been outstanding. Mm. And any Man U fan, I mean, he's the most sought after now. It was always Ronaldo, but right at the moment, probably Rashford's alongside him. I know Ronaldo's left, but the Man U fans still want Ronaldo. But this guy is hot, hot again, you know. He's in, he's, he really is a great player. And again, that's hand signed by Marcus Rashford. Great gift for anyone, you know, put that in a frame, hang mm. it in your favourite place it's going to look wonderful it really is yeah really important to say that as well with all of these you know uh, personally signed so he's, he's held the pen in his hand he's yeah. had that there and signed it right in, in front that's of you that's right so no, signed it for you yeah, yeah. You get that. and you move, if you are buying one of these for the first time do keep the certificate keep all the paperwork that comes with it because it does it's got the AFTEL and the CLOGO or UACC or PDSL sometimes all of them but keep all that because it People then know if you come the day you ever want to move it on or auction it or something like that, you've got the paperwork. You say, look, here it is. This is where I got it. I'm going to go, fine. Yeah. It's not like buying them blind on the internet. And you know, is it real? Is it not real? Sadly, a lot of them aren't. That is real. So uh, yeah. grab it while you can. And honestly, they look the absolute business. As, as you know, I, I love my uh, rugby shirts. I've got a few of these. Like, you get them, get them all framed up, up on the wall. I mean, yeah. and they, I, I don't know about anyone else, but it just makes me smile when I see my, my yeah, collections at home. And that's what it's about. That's it is it's about uh, collecting is about nostalgia it's about memories and it's about sometimes childhood where you relive it you know you the wives or the girlfriends <laughs> or the husbands as well it could be you know when the, your partner let's say you know has a collection that takes them back to their younger yeah. days you know it could be oh i collect stamps when i was a kid oh i collect stamps again now oh i collected trading cards oh i collect trading cards now you know it turn, it turns full cycle often but the great thing is when you have a collection it does bring you exactly you said immense pleasure great great pleasure um, that is Marcus Rashford's personally signed Manchester United football shirt if you want to grab it it's £229.99 270837 is the item number 5750 is your first of four payments on Clearpay and again use that code SAVE at checkout uh, you can use it up until the 11th of March uh, to save yourself an extra 10% off that price if you want to shop online of course it's collectiblesguru.com free phone number in case I haven't mentioned it is 0800 254 5402 now if you're a football fan and indeed a Manchester United fan you quids in this evening because not only have we got that amazing Marcus Rashford shirt but um, Cristiano Ronaldo and I know now he's left um, I imagine there's a lot of Man United fans wish that he hadn't but um, still a, gr a great collector's piece this isn't still it? a great player he's still much loved and admired I mean he's been a fabulous player according to the media you know all things went a bit little bit off the wobble yeah. in the later years but he's a great Great player. Whatever mm. you do, again, I was talking about it earlier in another show about Harry Kane. Yeah, you know, I'm old school. You know, you want this guy should be back up the pitch, terrorising the opposition. You don't want him coming back tackling fullbacks. Normally, forwards like that are, are, are not you. They give away penalties because not used to it. His job's up the end. Leave him up the you top. Know. He's a great finisher. He's been a magnificent servant to who Man United, Real Madrid, Portugal. He's, you know, people say he's getting on now, but he's still. He's a great player. If you play to the strengths of Cristiano Ronaldo, you know you're going to be in with a great chance. And what is he? Uh, five times was he FIFA player? He's well, five player or six, year. isn't he? I think it's five. Yeah, I think it's Messi six and him five so far. Yeah. But he's a fabulous player, a great servant, and the Man U fans still love him. You know, maybe some have gone off him now. He's gone. <laughs> They're a bit, bit fickle when they leave, but he's still really, really popular. And as soon as you put something of Cristiano Ronaldo out there that signs someone's going to be getting on the phones quick or on the internet to grab it. Yeah, we touched on this the other day, didn't we, when we had an, um, an Mbappe uh, signed item. You know, you look at the Ronaldo, already talked about as one of the greatest footballers of all time. And, mm. you know, uh, you know, eventually when he does retire, these are the kind of things, aren't they, that people are going to be looking out for, that are going to be coming more sought after. W without doubt. And um, because he had such a successful stint, or uh, two stints, but yeah, United. At Man United, mm. I mean, he was top goal scorer. I can't 
time. I might have scored one season. Was it about 30 it was something? Ridiculous it was amount. unbelievable. Yeah, it was. Amazing talent. But it's like a lot of things, you know. I mean, <laughs> a football manager, I'm saying with rugby, you play to your strengths, you know. He's a manager of all sports. you got a guy sports. like that. You want him up the front. All <laughs> yeah. you want is the players that can get down the wing and cross the ball in and put it to him, you know. Yeah, yeah. I don't want him back tackling. I want him up there, you know. But anyway, that's me. That's why I'm not a football manager. Well, you, know, you, manager you say yeah. that, though. He, 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 he knows his collectibles. He gives you all the football knowledge here. Whilst we were uh, just chatting before the show, he was telling me all about his rugby tactics as well. What Gazza doesn't know, it worth knowing, I'm telling you. Well, yeah, it's always been the best means of defence is attacking, <laughs> yeah. I think. So, yeah, if you want a bit of Cristiano, grab him quick because always well sought after. Yeah. Very little available now. And um, as you say, as the years tick by, they'll always be looking around for it. Uh, yeah, just to let you know again, um, a, a, a small amount of those available right now. So 297315, it's the Manchester United 2021 22 football shirt, personally signed by Ronaldo. A lovely, lovely piece that. £349.99. Use that code SAVE, get another 10% off until the 11th of March. And use ClearPay too, that is available for you to spread the cost interest free over four payments, whether you're on the phones or whether you're shopping on the web. Right, let us move on back to the world of music we've got some great items tonight what oh, a yeah. show this is yeah. um, and we're looking next at uh, one of two items we've got uh, as far as David Bowie is concerned this is the 12 by 10 um, photo I, I just love this picture so much um, it almost like sums the guy up doesn't it this pose it's yeah I mean one a colleague of mine uh, a guy who watches Baz I'm sure he'll be watching I won't say it's from Baz from Essex he's bought quite a few items and uh, he bought a Bowie I think it was for one of his uh, friends, we'll put it that way. I can't remember what her name was, but anyway. <laughs> yeah, okay. I don't, did I say her? I didn't know. <laughs> <laughs> but Bowie bought a Bowie, and then he saw this one, and he went, oh, I had to have it, because it's it is. It's, it's a fantastic photograph of David Bowie. And you can see the smoke there. He's probably having a sneaky cigarette, you know, in the days when you're allowed to. Yeah. But um, it, it, it's hand signed by the man himself. Uh, we, we only have the one of these, yeah. and we, they're very, very rare now. And actually, for a David Bowie, if you check around for a genuine Bowie that you've got with good provenance, that is actually a good price. Most of them now, I know I do a few of these charity auctions. Most Bowie stuff, the last time I've done charity auctions, I can tell you where and when if you don't believe me, but Bowie has always sold for a 1,000 to £1,500 upwards. Mm. He is very, very hard to get, very popular. And uh, again, we got this. We always pass it to you at the price we get. We had a good link in with the studio where he used to work in the States. It's virtually dried up now. You just get the odd one now and again. We had this image before. They said we had another one, so I just snapped it up. And it is, for a Bowie, that is a good price. It's a piece of music history, well, well sought after. And if you're looking something that's, you know, rare and going to always be highly desirable, that's exactly what you got there. I mean, he was, as an artist, I mean, he was brilliant when he, he was like a fashion icon. He was a he's always reinventing you know, his music, himself, constantly he? reinventing himself. Mm. You know, his sexuality, his music, everything. He, he just took people into avenues they'd never been in before, you know, even become an actor in the end, didn't he? Um, he really did, you know, great performer, great, great thing. And so much of his music, you know, when you think something like, uh, one of, what was it, I'm a, I'm a little no, you know, gnome. Yeah. yeah, that was, that was in the yeah, 60s, wasn't really? it? Really, yeah. 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 And then you get, and then Space Oddity, Space Oddity. really put him on the yeah. map. And then, then he would come in with something like, you know, uh, Let's, Let's dance, dance, which was very different. Yeah, changes. You know, changes, just so talented. Did the duet with uh, Mick Jagger as well? Yeah, did, he he did the Mick the Jagger, street? yeah. Sang with Bing Crosby, of course. Yeah, highly, well. highly talented guy. Yeah. And um, will be remembered always through music and if you know someone who loves Bowie maybe you've got a special occasion anniversary or a wedding it could be anything a birthday retirement have a little think because all of these items in this show a lot of them are you know are, are conceived part, part purchases considered purchase sorry yeah and um, you know but have a think maybe club your money together buy them something they'll always want because whatever you've got whether you're a millionaire or you're living as a pauper <laughs> I don't know <laughs> <laughs> you will love that. That is a gift you'll cherish forever. It really is. Fabulous picture of him and hand sign. Yeah. Much sought after, like we said, because a guy who's around, you know, 60s, 70s, 80s, 90s, music, movies, I mean, super talented. Uh, good luck uh, grabbing that one because I have a funny feeling there's going to be a lot of people wanting to get it. 
799.99 is the price. And you can save yourself a hefty old chunk there by using that code. And if you want to use ClearPay, that's available for you as well. So you can split the cost over four payments, £200. But of course, it'd be less than that if you use that code. The item number is 304816. Um, I, I love that. It's a beautiful, beautiful mm. piece, uh, personally signed by uh, David Bowie, uh, that photo on stage, 304816. All right, moving on, swiftly on to another David Bowie item, uh, and this is coming back to those um, amazing gold discs, which uh, seem to be very, very popular. Yeah. Uh, and this is uh, Aladdin Sane, isn't it? Aladdin Sane, yeah, great one. Again, one of his most famous albums, that, again, took it took him for another sort of era of music, or another corner, another area, really, but a very popular album. It's the same idea as the other one, 24 by 20 inches, big piece, comes with a great photograph of him, and the gold, this one's the gold disc, and once Again, only uh, only a hundred of these in total. Mm. So, and obviously we have nowhere near a hundred. I think now there's less than twenty. So they are very very special. And whichever one you get, remember you'll be the only person in the world that's got that number. And they don't suddenly do another lot. No, I see. If it. they do anything, they go on to the platinum version. Yeah, and that's it. But so these are very very special. And if you own one, you're gonna you know you are genuinely going to be one of only a hundred people in the world to have it. Bowie's massive. These have proven so popular because a lot of Bowie fans, you look for buy them something you know they're going to love and admire and hang pride of place in the home or the work or office or even in, you know, maybe you've got someone with a bar or a, a restaurant or a media business. These look stunning. They really do. Yeah, we, like you say, 100 of these were produced. Uh, we, we've got a lot less than that available. Beautiful, beautiful piece. Again, nice size, big head turner, 24 by 20, that one. Frame gold disc and photo display. Limited edition of 100. It is David Bowie's Aladdin Sane. Uh, once again here, £249.99. But spread the cost, use that clear pay. So you can pay just £62.50 today. Be your first payment of four. Uh, and that price comes down even lower for you as well if you use the code. We're doing so many great deals for you at the minute on the, the Collectibles Guru. It's 10% off all orders with code SAVE until the 11th of March. 390488 is the item number on that one. Lots on the website as well. If you um, haven't seen anything yet on this show that uh, tickles your fancy, call your to please, aren't you? Yeah. Uh, but, <laughs> but there's lots more on the website, and that code you can use um, up until the 11th of March on anything on the website. Been mentioning a lot about ClearPay though, and for those of you who want some more information about that, have a look. Spread the cost of your next online purchase with four interest-free instalments when you check out with ClearPay. Simply shop the website at collectiblesguru.com, add your favourite items to your basket, and then select the ClearPay option at the checkout. Log in or create a free ClearPay account for an instant approval decision, and then your purchase will be split into four interest-free payments every two weeks. For more information about using ClearPay, visit collectiblesguru.com. Pay it in four with ClearPay. Welcome back. There we go. Some information there for you uh, about ClearPay. Let's move swiftly on, though, to any fans of uh, sci-fi, particularly Star Trek. These next three items are going to be of major interest to you, I think. I think these are brilliant. Um, taking a bit of a step back in time and having a look at these uh, limited edition 12-inch uh, figures. Um, again, really hard to come by and it was it was a limited edition of 5000 of these were made yeah this one was a limited edition that's worldwide as well of only 5000 yeah and obviously they were done quite some time ago now so these are they come in their original boxes which adds considerably to the value or interest for a collector there will be marks on the boxes or maybe where seller tapes bin and stuff but that to have it in its original format is far, far more desirable mm. than having it repackaged. So obviously we've left them how they were originally produced in the box with all the original, with the accessories and everything with it. But all three of them there that you can see, great characters from uh, Star Trek. The one in the middle, of course, we're talking about most of all is Captain James Kirk. Yeah. You know, hence William Shatner. I've seen him at a couple of conventions and the queues for him are massive. 
Mm. Massive. Well, he's just a bit up in space, seen... isn't he? Yeah, and that's right, yeah. And I've never seen anyone sign quicker than him. Oh, seriously? If you've been to a, a convention, you know what I mean? He's like... He's like... I wouldn't be rude enough to say that when they're charging you what they charge you for the photos, he's increased his speed writing, I think. But he does sign very quick. I mean, that's... Well, I don't really. But he uh, he certainly signs fast. But, um, I suppose he's got to, because otherwise he'll be there all day, wouldn't he? He'll be there all day, Beating yeah. up Scotty. But here's your chance to get an original figure, a real piece of... The real Star Trek nostalgia, memorabilia, everything. Ticks all those boxes. And most people, if you do get this, don't take it out. Keep it all in there together because certainly just put it in place and display it because come the day you want to move that on or sell it in a specialist auction it is always going to be far more desirable if it's kept in its original packaging yeah and as you, as you can see he comes with his own uh, weapon it's actually called an anti-vulcan dueling weapon and yeah. if you notice as well nice little touch the base that um they all come on is actually the um the sort of uh, the, the star trek logo that they've got on their on their tops yeah which is a nice little touch that actually yeah um, but yeah, like highly collectible, as you said, for any Star Trek fan, I would imagine you'd be wanting to. Captain Kirk, you'll definitely want to um, snap up. I know we've had uh, Spock on previous shows as well. Yeah. Um, oh, yeah. That's a great price too, seventy nine ninety nine for something. Well, it's so something. It's, it is. This is. You have to compare this with an antique. Yeah. It's an antique collectible, an antique sort of TV film collectible, really desirable, really sought after, and really rare. And so you're buying it as a, a on the secondary market the same as you would in an auction sale in you know one of the major auction houses like Sotheby's Christie's Bonham's mm. you know somebody like that or Julian's in America they're the way you'd expect maybe to see something like that or in a museum very very rare to get anything like that. I can't recall ever having a figure of this age from Star Trek on the TV before so these are very very rare they're true collector's items but if you're building a collection or you want a special gift for somebody in Star Trek, maybe who's been there from the beginning or the early days, what a fabulous gift. They'll hang this, well, they won't hang this, they'll put it in a cabinet or something, mm. uh, display it in a unit, it's going to look stunning. But whoever you buy it for, again, they're going to cherish that as a gift forever. Yeah, 461682, so that's Captain Kirk. It's uh, the 12-inch figure in the original box, limited edition with all the accessories we chatted around as well. £79.99 or £20 today on clear pay, first payment of four. Now, you might have noticed that uh, Captain Kirk has got two other members there of the Starship Enterprise. And do you know what I like about these, actually? Whilst, in, in my little mind, I think, obviously, people are going to want to collect your, you know, your, your Kirks and your Spocks, I, I would have thought these other um, characters who perhaps might not be as well known mm. as Captain Kirk are going to be highly desirable as well, I would have thought. Well, they will because, you know, probably you, you, wouldn't, you wouldn't necessarily, they'd escape. I mean, everybody knows the major, major characters like Spock and Captain Kirk. But these are these are equally as important. As you can see, an international edition, once again with this. Same idea, same period. You've got the figure, the 12-inch figure. You've got quite a few accessories with it. And it again, again is in its uh, original box. This one is uh, Le Lieutenant Marlena Moreau, Moreau, isn't it? Yeah. Mm. Very French, yeah, it's a Francais. <laughs> and the uh, collector's figure in the original box, the international edition. Yeah. yeah. It's like dances in five languages, apparently. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Sorry. Very good. <clears throat> but it doesn't, I'm only kidding. No. <laughs> if you can hum in five languages, then it will dance in five. You move it around, you know. Anyway, forget that. <laughs> but they look great, you know. And as I said, if you are a collector, as uh, Ben quite rightly said, probably some of these sort of other, uh, you know, when I say lesser characters, but they're not quite so world known no. as your Kirks, but become, that actually means they're probably even harder to get or it's hard to get. That's what I'm saying, Because yeah. there's not, you know, they're not sort of there, but all of them are a great, highly collectible. Or if you're building a collection, imagine them displayed together. If you bought them today, look how much you're going to save with all the money off. You're almost going to get one for the, it's nearly, well, maybe not quite, but we take that money off, you know, you're talking about almost half of one of them is going to cost you 
you know, it's like two and a half, isn't it, really? Yeah, absolutely. By my maths, I think. Yeah. yeah. I, I love it as well, because on the, on the reverse of these, it tells you about, obviously, um, she comes with all the different accessories as well, and it gives you, like, um, other of the characters that you can, you know, potentially look out for. So if you love the ideas of collecting these, obviously you can pick up uh, Kirk from us. Maybe you picked up Spock recently. You've got Moreau here. We'll show you um, the nurse in just a second as well, but then you've got all of those other characters that potentially, you know, you can look out for to complete the collection. Uh, but that's amazing. Lieutenant Marlena Moreau. Uh, again, first come, first served on that one. Uh, 410588 is the item number uh, for her international edition. 79.99, or again, £20 on your clear pay. And then we come to the uh, final character we've got from this range this evening, Nurse Christine Chapel, who again was um, in the original series. Um, a, a character as well I seem to uh, recall was in a few of the, um, the movies as well when Star Trek took to the, mm. the big screen um, but yeah again a, a, another great character to add to the collection isn't she yeah it's, it's the same story again you come she comes with a few accessories there and um, again she's st a Starfleet command figure was they call it mm. in the again in the original box exactly as it was produced all those many many years ago but obviously for its age and as an antique a film antique it's very very you know really rare and in exceptional condition so again something if you, maybe if you're looking for one character or a few, but again, it's going to look really great wherever you display it. I would advise if you're buying these as collectibles, do leave them in the box. Oh, Don't yeah. take them out because mm -hmm. they will lose about 20% of their value as soon as you open the box. Sad that it is, but it's a fact, you know. If you leave them in that original box and if you ever wanted to sell them, you'd probably get at least 20 to 25% more if they're in the original packaging. It's like the old dinky cars, the same, you know, if they're in the original. If they're in their original boxes, original packaging, it's worth an awful lot more. So keep them as they are. Sad though, it's pretty want to play them, but put them away and just look at them and remember it. Bring all the memories flooding back. That's it. And do you know what? Again, I know uh, you're going to get that discount this evening, but if, how great do those three look displayed uh, side by side by side? So again, if you're a big Star Trek fan, if you're loving these, maybe pick up all three tonight. Th there is only one of each, so it will be uh, potentially you know, if someone decides I'm having them all, that's it, they're gone. Um, so do have a quick think about that. And remember, you know, you can pick these up tonight, use that save code and get an extra 10% off the item number for Nurse Christina Chapel is 412210 and she is 7995. And of course, you can still use ClearPay as well. If you're wondering what that is by a shoulder, I'm just looking at the back here. That's her biological sense and sound visual recording system. In case you were in case you were wondering. Yeah. We use a lot of those here in the studio <laughs> on Collectibles Guru. Yeah, yeah. Uh, 412210 is the item number. Enough Star Trek for now. Let's jump on a wrecking ball and swing on over to Miley Cyrus. Uh, do you want me to do that, really? <laughs> no, 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 I've got a terrible no, image no, no, in my head no, now. No. He said it, didn't he? <laughs> Daniel's just doing, said yeah. we need to reinforce the beams if we had that in the studio. <laughs> yeah, cheeky. <laughs> <laughs> He'll get you after the show, don't you worry yeah, about that. Yeah. This is a great <laughs> piece though, uh, Gazza, tell us about this. Well, I, last time I heard Miley Cyrus is in town, she was looking for me for a dance partner. Is that right? Yeah, but it was someone with my name anyway. Right, yeah. Apparently. yeah. Maybe that was it. She got the name wrong. The, I think it's probably... <laughs> I think it was, was him. Yeah. She was looking <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, Miley Cyrus, you know, a highly talented young lady, really hot at the moment. Really, I mean, every time you open a TV magazine or an internet, she's she's there, isn't she? Yeah. But it's a great image of her. Three great... It's, we call it called a photo montage display. Three great great photographs of her there and uh, it comes with a plaque and that is a genuine hand signed signature so it's beautifully framed and mounted this is one of those uh, 16 by 12 this one but it's a big piece and it's professionally framed and mounted it's not a, it's not a, a, a you know a cheaper shop frame it's one of those they frame and mount together we should say actually on some of these uh, framed items like this you please allow a bit longer for delivery because they are handmade so they take probably five to seven working days at sometimes occasionally it takes longer at busy periods but usually five to seven working days for those frames to be made they're not just there and you 
put them on. So it will take a bit longer. But when it comes, you'll be over the moon. You'll love it, I tell you. Absolutely, you, you will be. And again, uh, you know, just look at those images of her there. Reinvented herself from the times when, uh, remember she used to be on kids TV as Hannah Montana, wasn't she? Oh, yeah. And then yeah. Uh, bit, bit, a little bit like um, Ariana Grande now is on all of the uh, kids TV shows on Nickelodeon. She really reinvented herself and now is a major pop star. And same with Miley <laughs> Cyrus. Um, for, mm. for any fan, you know, whether it was a, a fan of her TV shows or indeed all of her music now as well. That's a great, great piece. Uh, 16 by 12. Love it. Looks the absolute business. And of course, signed, personally signed by Miley Cyrus. 429.99 is your price. 107.50 on clear. Pay your first to four. Uh, and of course, you can save yourself an extra 10% with that code save up until the 11th of March. 360410. Uh, whether you're shopping with us at the website collectiblesguru.com or if you're giving us a call 0800 254 5402. Right, next up for um, music lovers, this is a great piece um, from Depeche Mode. Now, um, talk us around these guys because vinyl, uh, we've been chatting about over the last few weeks, very, very hot and, and <coughs> these very collectible, aren't they? Yeah, most of these discs we've had on are, they, they produced them, they're actually what they call European exclusives generally. Yeah. They're made on mainland Europe. Um, I understand from the maiden wholesaler who brings them into the country, who has, the, I think, a pretty exclusive license on them that usually there's less than 150 to 200 max ever come to the UK and what they are you they're orig they, they actually uh, in almost every case they're uh, recordings of live concerts that these various bands or acts did which went out on radio stations and it's like in other words it's the radio stations version of the live concert oh, that I went see. out on air and they've all the you know all the rights are paid and everything else through the uh, through the society everybody gets the the, the particular rights or they cover it or they they're cut or whatever you call <laughs> yeah. it you know so i'm told but what's really why these have gone nuts this is a double album uh, most of them are single this is a double album hence yeah. the higher price but basically as well the discs come in various colors this one is what they call crystal vinyl looks amazing so there you can see the two things now two vinyl discs now when you look at, you know, I was talking the other week, I don't know if you saw it, we're talking here about going to record fairs and things now. Used to be old codgers like me wandering around, you know, get out of the way of the Zimmer frame while you're looking at the record. <laughs> but now it's all these young people, they're all diving around, you know. Yeah. It's like Peter, my grandkids' age, you know, a little, well, a little bit older maybe. And, um, it's, it's massive. Vinyl now is ages, no ageist about it. It's all ages and it's red, red hot. And uh, whatever you want, I was meant to say it's not ageist, but anyway, but I get all excited. I love vinyl. I grew up with vinyl and I think it's terrific that it's come full circle. And when you go there now, <coughs> excuse me, you see all these remastered versions and you'll see them in the big supermarkets and the stores mm. doing remastered versions of albums from the 50s, 60s, 70s, 80s. And they're like 50, 60 pounds sometimes. 40s is cheap. Well, when you think what you're getting here, there's less than four, well, 400 of these produced, less than 200 come into the UK. Coloured vinyl, which makes them very desirable and collectible. These fly. Mm. They sell really out really quickly. We only have a handful, most cases less than single figures now. So if you want them, get in quick. And I believe at this price, these are something special for that price. Whereas I'd much rather pay this sort of money for something that like this, so few of them, than a remastered version for not much different, yeah. you know. And these are special. So if you want them, a lot of people I know have bought, I don't mean to tell you to do this, but have bought two of these and they'll frame one up yes. and the other one they'll play. Because yeah. they don't want to mess it up because you keep it together, unframed. These collectible items, put them in a frame, they look stunning, they really do. Depeche Mode, good band, been around. This one's called Waiting for the Night. Yes. And uh, again, really special. And again, crystal vinyl. So if you're looking for something rare, unique, different and very few of them that's exactly what you've got with these discs and and whilst i won't go through them all i'm just picking off some of the um big songs that i know as far as depeche mode are concerned on this album you've got master and servant on there you've got enjoy the silence you've got personal jesus so some um, really big hits on there and you know for any depeche mode fan i would have thought that is one that you would want to snap up and like uh, gaza says you know what if you want to keep one to maybe frame and another set to perhaps obviously listen to the music on uh, go swiftly because again we don't have a huge 
huge amount of those. So it's a double album, that one, with that gorgeous crystal vinyl. You've got um, 8, 11, there's 14 songs on there. So uh, really, really enjoy that. 79.99 or 20 pounds if you are going the clear pay way 302 312 still got more items to bring to you three absolute crackers before the end of the show but as we always say uh, we bring you a selection of items on these shows just a you know a few items that you can get your hands on all the rest of the goodies are at the website and here's more details about it Welcome to CollectiblesGuru.com, your trusted source for genuine collectibles and memorabilia. Here you can shop by category to browse hundreds of items from the world of sport, TV and film, music, heritage and our selection of gift ideas. If you're looking for something more specific, why not browse our most popular subcategories including boxing, football, Hollywood greats, royalty and Star Wars. Or if you've seen something you like on TV, just search the item number here to find out more details and to add to your basket. Plus, when you shop online, you have the option to spread the cost of your order with four interest-free installments when you select the clear pay option at the checkout. Now, if you want to find out why you can trust Collectibles Guru, then read our authenticity guarantee, including Gaza's top tips for when it comes to buying items of memorabilia. And if you've missed any of our fabulous shows, just click the TV catch-up page and you can watch us on demand. So log on to CollectiblesGuru.com, where the world of collectibles and memorabilia is only a click away. Yeah, treasure trove to delve into, have a look, and of course, new items have been added all the time. Three items to bring you in the last 10 minutes and three absolute crackers. We've got Will Smith on the way. Also, Tina Turner, but first up, something which packs a bit of a knockout punch. Ooh. Yeah, for all boxing fans. Uh, Iron Mike Tyson, one of the big names in the business, uh, and you've got a, a wonderful piece signed by the man himself, Gazza. Yeah, Mike Tyson, what a talent he was, a hellish boxer. The youngest, I believe he's still the youngest ever heavyweight world champion yeah but he, well, he used to be oh, frightening and he was awesome real tough cookie um, these were actually signed but these come from the same company uh, that we deal with that Mike uh, sorry Tyson Fury is associated with so they knit all the virtually all our boxing comes from the one source okay and they're the guys who go to a lot of these fights with the merchandise certainly with Tyson Fury worldwide they'd have the official merchandise and they produce like we've got the robe the gloves you know and all that but Mike Tyson um, they've done a couple of signings well I think more than one now two Mike Tyson because he's very popular sells out but this particular sign I believe was done in Vegas before the Fury Wilder second fight. They had pictures of him signing and everything. It was all done there out in Vegas, you know, when the uh, the proprietor, the owner of the company was there, you know, having them. So he's actually got pictures of, of uh, Mike Tyson sitting in his suite signing the photos, you know. Can't be bad, and the, and the gloves. Yeah. But Mike Tyson, always really popular. As soon as you get someone starting a boxing collection, or maybe of gloves or photos or whatever, this guy, it's got to be in there. I mean, he was an awesome boxer, really frightening. You know, he had power he had. And he wasn't the biggest man in the world, was he? But, no, you know, but terrifying. Yeah, he looked, he had that look about him that meant he's here of business, wouldn't he? Yeah. You know? If someone said, well, she can't say that, but if someone said to me, I always joke like I'd get in the ring and let someone beat me up for <laughs> the money, but it probably wouldn't take long, you know. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah our, our director just said there'd be a cure for you. Yeah. It's all about my beloved, she'd be there, you know. She'd take the thing off, wouldn't she, though, know, you know. Take the glove off, sorry. She'd oh. take the glove off, whack me, you know, yeah. terrible. But no, Mike Tyson, great, great talent. He really is, amazing talent. Yeah. And that is hand signed by the man himself. Look at that. Yeah, for any serious boxing collector, if you haven't yet got a Mike Tyson piece in your collection, this is something you absolutely need to pick up. Wonderful piece. It is uh, 296990, personally signed by Iron Mike himself. Uh, and you can get that today for £72.50 if you're using Clearpay. That'd be your first payment of four. Uh, 289.99 is your um, price on it. And of course, if you use that code today as well, you can save an extra 
10%. But like, like we said, you know what, it, it, it is a signature that you want in your collection. I know we talk a lot on this show about Tyson Fury, he's obviously the man of the moment. Mm. I mean, I mean, Tyson during the sort of 80s was, it was almost unbeatable, wasn't he, really? Oh yeah, he was um, He was a mean machine, you know. I mean, there was a lot of good boxers around, but he, he was... He was just always looked so frightening, didn't he? Yeah. I mean, when he got caught and he lost, you think, wow, you know, but mm. he, he's always come across as a real, real tough, hard man, you yeah. know? Yeah, uh, 296990 for that Mike Tyson personally signed boxing glove. Finishing off with a bit of music, uh, this next item, love it, it is Tina Turner, Simply Live, special collector's edition, 399745, uh, it's 59.99 or £15 on clear pay today. And this is another one of those um, sort of special editions, recorded live concerts, isn't it? Yeah, live concert again. Um, it's basically the live concerts that took place Placed on, but the concert was broadcast on a radio station, normally in the country yeah. that it was from. This one, of course, uh, Tina Turner. Okay, it's simply, I mean, obviously, we're simply the best. This is simply live. Yeah, Tina it's in Turner, California. But again, these are European exclusives, so they were never available in America, the Far East, Japan, China, places like that. So, of course, with the internet now, they go bonkers trying to get hold of these because everybody wants them you know you can only get them so these have a massive cult following and once again tina turner massively a huge following tina turner i've seen her live she's great on stage as well you know yeah. i saw her in the early days when she started up on her own you know and she was amazing she had a couple of very pretty dancers on as well actually but anyway um f fell in love with them as well but. he remembers all of the finer <laughs> points don't oh, you? She had oh nice that. eyes <laughs> And one <laughs> one of the was. dancers, we were sitting in the second row, and she seemed to keep waving. I said to my wife, she's waving at me. She <laughs> said, no, if she was waving at you, she'd be using just two fingers. I'm like, oh, that's <laughs> nice, isn't it? You know what I, mean? I won't say no more. But <laughs> Tina Turner, really special. And uh, great, got some great uh, songs on it. Nutbush City Limits. Yeah, you know. Private Dancer. Yeah, we... We don't need Even another hero, people. can't stand a rain. She's great, great, great act. And again, this is in the blue vinyl. So remember, less, there was only about 400 ever produced, but usually between 150 and 200 maximum ever come to the UK. And a big chunk of those are snapped up by the big high street guys who, you know, who've got branches around the country. I'm sure you know what I mean. They take a percentage. So we've just got literally a handful. It's single numbers left of this. But once all of these discs, all the varying discs of these type that we have, the vinyl, once they sell out, there are no more. They've gone. That's it. They're finished. So I can't replace any of them. Um, and so do keep looking. There's some new ones, I believe, out in the spring and autumn. So uh, spring, later in the spring. And we've got lots of others on the website. Do have a little look there. But once they're gone, that is it. We definitely won't be able to bring them back. They'll have gone completely. Yeah, this one uh, recorded July 1993. Yeah, and all those songs and there's some brilliant ones foreign affair private dancer we don't know that need another hero from uh, mad max of course i can't stand the rain then you got nutbush what's love got to do with it and addicted to love so that's your your line up there and um, if you do decide that you're getting one to play and one to display then well you're gonna have to be very quick because we have a handful of these available so mm. uh, make your mind up time fairly swiftly on that tina turner simply live special collector's edition 12 inch album with that gorgeous blue vinyl uh three double nine seven four five is the item item number uh, £59.99 or save yourself an extra 10% by using that code SAVE at checkout. And we finish up the show this evening on an item I've been really looking forward to seeing, which is the Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. Yes, yeah. anyone else singing the song? Uh, Will Smith. So uh, personally signed by the, the, the man himself, but with all of the the, the, the Fresh Prince pictures. Yeah, it's great, isn't it, this piece? Yeah. I mean, Will Smith's great. I love Will Smith, great actor. But you've got those great, uh, what, three images of him there, three three images of him there, uh, and his genuine hand signed signature. You've got the plaque there, beautifully framed and mounted. It's uh, a 16 by 20 in size, so it's a big piece, but again, professionally mounted uh, by, by um, you know, bespoke framing. So, in other words, it's made up individually. It's not a, 
a shop frame would you stick on there. Yeah. That sort of frame would cost, you know, probably 80 or 100 pounds at least to get it framed. Beautifully made. Yeah. And all of those frames are on those bespoke ones, really top stuff. So they look brilliant. It just finishes them off. That's like a piece of art. You take it off, just hang it on your favourite wall. Can't go wrong. I think it's brilliant. I mean, if you're of the sort of similar age to me, you'll have remembered uh, getting home to watch the Fresh Prince on BBC Two of, a, of an afternoon. And um, I mean, that was so hugely popular. And then, of course, he had his uh, rap career with DJ Jazzy Jeff. And then from there, Drop That became Will Smith. And, you know, yeah. I mean, he still is now. He's still bashing out huge movies. But he, I think at one point he was like the, the, the top man in Hollywood, wasn't mm -hmm. he? Yeah. Yeah, he um, he he's massive, isn't he? You know, mm. he's, you see him at the film, you know, the film launches and the premieres and things. Yeah, and he always has his, uh, he always has, um, you know, sort of a massive following. The cameras are on him all the time, aren't they? Absolutely right. Yeah, and and this kind of taking you back to, I think, where it all started for him as well. That uh, Fresh Prince of Bel Air. I love it. I love the pictures. Love the fact that you've got that signature, uh, and it's a uh, nice size as well, sixteen by twenty. That frame photo montage display of Will, the Fresh Prince. 421284 is your item number. 429.99 is the price. Once again, I keep saying it, you can save yourself a, a, an extra bit, well actually nearly £43 on that by using that code SAVE. 10% off until the 11th of March with that code and that's across everything okay so everything that we've shown you on this show but indeed on the website as well and it's worth just touching on that again isn't it the, the website there's like a treasure trove of goodies on there isn't it oh yeah and it's constantly changing so do check it on a regular basis keep checking it there's items on there that are so they put them on there and they'll never come on the tv because they sell so quick so keep watching the keep looking at the website regularly if there's something you want that you haven't seen send us an email let us know or give us a call and we will give you a call back and try and get what you want absolutely Absolutely brilliant. Well, listen, thank you so much for joining us again on this show. Hopefully you've seen something you like. If not, do check out the website. Uh, and if there's nothing there yet, maybe we'll see you again next week for even more. See you later. See ya. You've been watching a commercial presentation brought to you by Collectibles Guru.